I tell everyone, I don't know if you've seen How I Met Your Mother, but <laughs> Sammy and Travis are just like Lily and Marshall. They're like the couple, that's what everyone looks for in life. Like that's the love that everyone dreams about having. She, I'm gonna start crying, looks gorgeous. And I tried really hard not to cry. But I'm so happy for you, Sammy, and I'm so happy to be standing next to you today. Travis and Sam had a very interesting college relationship because he lived all the way here in Croswell and she lived down in Detroit. So watching them um, still have a very close relationship throughout college was awesome. And I know I've been with you for the past week and a half now and you know, we had fun at the bachelor party and then you went and disappeared with mom and Bog and everyone. And so we have had lots of fun, lots of drama, but it's here and all that matters you're going to marry Travis, so it's all good. They've been together for a long time. <laughs> they have, so they have a great relationship. They have a great bond together. They're just, they're perfect. <laughs> they're perfect for each other. He's a very, he's a very wonderful man. <laughs> they're a power couple. They are meant to be together. They could conquer the world with each other. I love you and you're one of the most amazing role models I've ever had in my entire life and I don't know what I would do without you. Um, they're high school sweethearts and you guys are the happiest couple I've known. I think one of my favorite memories with Sammy is living with you. Um, we went through a lot but we also learned a lot about each other and I know that I have a friendship with you and Travis that will never end and um, I'm just so grateful that we had that experience. One, two, three. Oh, oh she said yes! yes. <laughs>
I promise to support all your dreams and to respect our differences. I promise to stand by your side through thick and thin every single day. And last, lastly, I promise to be the best man I can possibly be for you so that we can make this marriage last eternity. Just as these grains of sand can never be separated and poured again into individual containers, so will be your marriage. By the power invested in me, by the American Marriage Ministries and the state of Michigan, I now pronounce you man and wife. You may now kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. and Mrs. Travis Overwolf. What do you want? I'm so glad for Father's Day, and I'm wishing you all the wealth, health, and happiness. Now, if everyone can raise their glasses for a beautiful couple, Travis and Sam, we do it. So, this is a story all about how these lovers got hitched and shared two love spouses. Now, let us take a minute, Jesse, right there. Here's a truly story that we love to share. In the town of Crossroads, yeah. started Blaze, passing notes in the seventh grade. Long hair tight, soccer in school, they were meant to be, but middle school is cruel. In high school, you're not, they now understood what it takes to make a relationship good. She got accepted he, to a school, he got scared. Said, you have to go to college, I'll be waiting right here. <laughs> she said, you're gonna count your cab, he said, come here. He had a dozen roses and the ring was near. If anything, I could say, the diamond was rare, but all she could do was say, oh, oh shut up! up. Yeah. <laughs> now let's fast forward to present day when, Sammy, when Travis gave Sammy his last name. All of you as witness, and with them sitting there, we present the bride and groom. The littles are here. Woo! Forever seems like a long time, but nothing seems like a long time. I am with you I feel like I'm walking on water Since the day that I asked your father To let go of his daughter So give me your blessing, sir I'll give her all that I've got It doesn't look like much But it sure feels like a lot Take my heart and take my hand Take my heart and take my hand Take my heart and take my hand again and again Right where we stand Whatever it is, I feel it in your 
So take my heart and take my hand. Take my heart, take my hand. Take my heart and take my hand again and again. Right where we stand. Take my heart. prettier than I thought it was going to be, so I'm very excited. <laughs> it actually turned out beautiful, beautiful. And Travis cried, and it's a good day. <laughs> I think that the best part of my day was when my dad let my stepdad dance with me, because I didn't think that was going to happen, ever. So that was cool. And it's everything that I dreamed of. <laughs> it all came together quite nicely. I'm so grateful that we were able to do it at Camp Cavell and on the lake. I'm glad that the weather was so beautiful. And I couldn't have hoped for a better wedding.